Z490 motherboard specifically designed for 10th and 11th generation processors and can sure do wonders in that area with its capability to uphold 2.5 GB per second Ethernet and Wi-Fi 6. Moreover, if you are into gaming then laying down your embellishment with Z940 motherboard is a splendid choice as they were first to work with Intel's LG A1200 socket chipset and can perform sufficiently well with 11th gen CPUs as well. Starting off with MSI Meg Z490 Gold-like motherboard, let me tell you beforehand, this motherboard is not a cheap purchase. This comes from the brand Godlike, which without doubt, has got a significant lead when it comes to the manufacturing of Intel Z490 motherboards. From its provisions till the price, it straightforwardly contends with ASRock's Z490 Taichi and Asus's Z490 ROG Maximus Xi Extreme. With an estimated retail price of $749.99, this motherboard isn't an easy decision. However, if you are far more concerned with what it has got to bring to the table and not the price tag then at that point this developer bundle is unquestionably worth considering. Once unpacked, you will discover that the extended ATX size Meg Z490 Godlike is for the most part dark, with only a couple of slim white lines and marks to add detail. You'll see some dim gray color tossed in the blend on different metal parts, however these are largely genuinely dim and don't stand apart much from a generally dark PCB. After the board is provided with power, which lights it up not too bright though, but rather lights on the back I.O. cover, and the motherboard chips it do add some life to the board. The lights on the back I.O. cover enlighten a snake picture that looks clever, however it likely will not be apparent relying upon where you place your PC. The Asus ROG Maximus Xi Extreme is the most recent release of the Maximus motherboard line which started around 10 years before which is probably the earliest entry into the ROG family. This one uses Intel's Z490 Express chipset and supports its LGA1200 attachment processors and Intel's 10th Gen Comet Lake CPUs. This isn't what you would call a worthwhile arrangement. However, the Maximus Xi Extreme expenses of $419 on Amazon at the time. It isn't the costliest motherboard out there for Intel's 10th era processors, yet it has all what you will possibly need. As this is one of the SUS lead motherboards, it should not shock anyone that the Maximus Xi Extreme comes furnished with first-class equipment. Taking a deep look at it, you'll recognize a coordinated 10 Gbps Ethernet regulator in addition to a slower yet still very incredible Intel i225 v 2.5 Gbps NIC. These two chips enable the board to get to the net phenomenally quickly over an appropriately provisioned wired association. On the off chance that you like to utilize Wi-Fi, the board additionally has an Intel Wi-Fi 6 regulator. However, it can't coordinate with the speed of the wired system's equipment. With a full pace of 2.4 Gbps, the AX201 is positively an expert. You'll simply need to have a Wi-Fi 6 viable remote modem to use it. The BIOS on this board has both an ES mode menu and an advanced menu, however upon first entering the BIOS you are taken straightforwardly to the advanced menu. As this is a top-of-the-line motherboard, you could contend that it needn't bother with an ES mode menu and that accomplished users will need to plunge straight into the advanced menu in any case. In case motherboards were broken into monetary classes, Asus ROG Strix Z490e Gaming would stand in an upper working class. This optimistic ATX board is extraordinary for gaming and overclocking, regardless of whether it can't exactly coordinate with other cutting-edge extravagant boards, for example, Asus own Maximus series motherboards concerning the provisions. Its price is prominently lower, and that makes it a great pick for any individual who needs the effect of a very good quality board yet doesn't have any desire to pay as much as possible for it. Contending with other top-notch boards like ASRock's Z490 Phantom Gaming Velocita, the ROG Strix has a little more to go assuming it needs to overwhelm in this segment of the market. Rather than the typical ROG shading plan, the ROG Strix Z490 E Gaming is as a rule dark with few different features to separate the look. When you get this ATX size block terminated from its packaging, you'll recognize some RGB LED set over the chipset heatsink and the back I.O. board. They add some truly necessary tone when fueled up. Concerning the thermal solution on this board, it comprises three heatsinks set around the CPU attachment. A long heat pipe runs between these heatsinks and attempts to protect it from overheating. 
Asus additionally added a fan section on the heatsink to one side of the CPU attachment. This empowers you to mount an included smaller than normal fan over the heatsink to drive more air into the last mentioned parts and assist further in keeping the motherboard cool. Also you can physically set the RAM clock speed, voltage, and timings, yet assuming you need to connect with a memory profile, you'll need to change to the easy mode menu, or modify the BIOS My Favorites tab, and add the choice there. Other than that peculiarity, the BIOS is exactly what you'd anticipate from a top-of-the-line Asus motherboard. You get plenty of alternatives to investigate for overclocking the CPU, RAM, and motherboard to assist you with extracting the most from your equipment. You can likewise discover apparatuses here to safely eradicate information from a SSD and for glimmering the system BIOS. The Meg Ace class motherboards are ordinarily MSI upper working class motherboards, on the off chance that you view the board creator's godlike models as the elite. Following from that, Meg Z490 Ace is one of the organization's top Z490 motherboards, however it isn't deceived with the extravagant features of the godlike line. It's likewise significantly more affordable, at a bit the greater part the Z490 godlike's cost, however it conveys, with keen board plan and a substantial supplement of I.O. The Meg Z490 Ace is painted dark and orange, with stripes of dim gray jabbing through from the metal heatsink and cover surfaces. This shading makes for a lovely difference in pace. A ton of top-of-the-line motherboards come in dark and red, and the impact can show up way exaggerated. The orange not just assists with separating the Meg Z490 Ace, however it likewise looks pleasing to the eyes. MSI furnished a board with 90 amp power stages that are cooled by a heat pipe and two thick heatsinks. A little fan set under the back I.O. cover pulls in air from the rear of the case to assist with cooling the thermal guideline parts, which can help with working on in general execution and lead to better overclocking results. The chipset heatsink on this board is tiny, however it connects with three other heatsinks that reach out over to M2 openings. This format permits the heatsinks to move heat from one to the next, as a result making them fill in as a component of one enormous heatsink. These heatsinks would all be able to be eliminated freely, which is useful and makes adding or eliminating M2 SSDs simpler. Additionally you will also experience a solitary inheritance PS2 port here, if you'd prefer to utilize a more established console or mouse. We would recommend another USB or 2 instead of that, however it's there assuming you need it. ASRock's Taichi is an optimistic top-of-the-line motherboard that stays within the long-running stuff theme. The Taichis are continually working on designing boards that will be worth looking at, and ASRock stirs up the plans from one stage to another, while keeping with the overall subject. The series consistently conveys a rich arrangement of elements and an appearance that is tastefully satisfying without being excessively showy. This particular Taichi board is unique, however. It looks and feels great, and keeping in mind that little subsets of price versus features may grumble around a couple of minor perspectives, it in any case offers superb performance depending on its cost. In case you're searching for a motherboard for outrageous gaming and overclocking, and don't have any desire to address leader class costs, this ASRock stage is an ideal decision for upper and 10th generation core CPUs. The Z490 Taichi is an ATX motherboard with noticeable heat spreaders that cover the majority of its surface. A greater amount of the board is uncovered around the CPU attachment and RAM spaces, however enormous areas close by are covered by a couple of huge heatsinks. These pieces of metal provide assistance with cooling the board's power guideline equipment, which comprises 15 force stages. Holding thermals under control is likewise performed by a couple of little fans joined to the highest heatsink and a metal heat pipe that runs between the two. As expected from a high-quality motherboard, the Z490 Taichi's organization highlights put on a display of being a little disappointing. ASRock picked to furnish this board with Realtex Dragon, which is presently being broadly utilized on mid-range and very good quality motherboards. Wrapping up, your purchase will highly be determined by your preferences and needs, and mostly your budget however, these were the top picks of the Z490 motherboards available in the market nowadays. We hope this video helps you in settling on the best product that will serve you for years to come. Do let us know your views in the comment section below.